This is the S&P 500 one-day reading for April 6, 2022. It's currently March 25th, just a little bit after midnight, 2022. The overall theme and behavior for the day is a breakdown through a support level to meet another support level, and then we bounce along that support level before breaking down through multiple support levels. So we go like this. Droop, 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 droop. boom, okay? That Unicursal card is significant, obviously. We also have the Prudence card. I threw down another card when I see that for help. Uh, the highs of fake out. Something to do with the meeting. Congress in the low. This is the S&P 500 one day reading for April 6th, 2022. It's currently April 3rd, 2022. The overall theme and behavior for the day. Looks like we have a, a breakdown after a bit of a rally early on, we have a breakdown. Um, There's a breakdown to a support through a support level to meet a second one. We bounce along that support level and then we break down further. We have a high correlator toward, uh, in the pre-market. Um, there's some sideways fluctuation with an upwards um, trend in it, right around the open and a push higher in the first half hour, notable push higher. Um, but there's caution advised um, because that high there around that first half hour turns into a decline that meets support and a day's low between roughly 10 and 11. Looks like we do push a little bit higher between 11 and 12 to meet a resistance level. And then midday, there's uh, there's another high correlator. Uh, another resistance price level is highlighted between roughly two and three. And then in the last half hour, we have some selling from nearly overbought on the RSI. There's a peak and we're nearly bought up, overbought on the RSI and there's selling top profit taking from that position in the last hour. Um, we have We have a, a bit of a rally, but it's kind of like a fake out rally uh, around the uh, around the close, like a bit of a move higher around the close. But there's also a low correlator. Um, day's low is going to be towards the end of the day. an agreement between two parties uh, between two leaders that's going to be highlighted around the high Senate's also going to be highlighted here looks like we have a lower low the following day on the 7th so a good opportunity to short here around that midday high or I actually already shorted I, I opened up some puts a while back like uh, it was on the 1st all right, guys, that's the April 6, 2022 reading for the S&P 500. Hope that helps. Let me know how you're doing. Um, if you got any strategies, love to see those comments and, and love the support from you guys. Really appreciate it. Um, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Don't forget to share.